Oh, what's in? Dead. <laughs> Don't let me shoot you. <laughs> what's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to another brand new video. In this video, I just finished editing um, a little gameplay that I did at Replay maybe like two weeks ago. You're going to see in the first half, I was using my GTP9 pistol. I probably have not seen this thing, but it is gorgeous. I only use it, this is my second time using it. I had a couple issues uh, regarding my nozzle. Nozzle, so this is my nozzle, right? This is a new one that I bought. These two tabs have pretty much broke off and that's what holds this little spring in, but that's what holds that spring in. Um, I was thinking maybe it was because of my sight. In the video, I had my sight on. I'm pretty sure the screw was loose. I'm going to go ahead and take this off for y'all. So in order to take this thing off, Press these two's down, uh, pull the slide back a little bit, and then release it, and it comes off. I'm pretty sure what was happening is my blowback housing was moving back and forth and causing my gun to misfeed, and it wasn't properly working with full mag. Uh, I had like full magazines, and it was only shooting like five shots. And I had like extended mags. The whole entire time I was just dealing with problems like the first half of the game. And then I switched to my new gun, which is the MP5. Let me go ahead and grab it for y'all. So this is my new MP5. I had it for a couple months, just like the pistol. Um, but the pistol I actually had since last year or early this year. I'm not sure. I just picked this up maybe about two two months ago and so in this video you're gonna see the first gameplay that I did with this thing it is an AEG it has 13 to 1 gears uh, Titan MOSFET not the full works but just like basic tasteful mods um, also the trigger is not changed or anything so stop trigger but I do have to do a refresh because I bought this thing uh, used and it has the HK slot so Getting back to this, I really think the screw just fell out of it um, because when I went to different airsoft day somewhere else, I lost both of my sights, which I had to buy a new pair of sights. So this is the rear sights, which is on the floor. And this is, I think that's what really happened is just like, it was just, the screw was just loose and causing the blowback housing to just be floppy. Or the nozzle just to be floppy around in there so i don't know i'm gonna go ahead and play the video tell me if i like these like little breakdowns before the gameplay um comment below tell me what y'all think and i'll include my face more so yeah peace out another thing i'm not sure if i actually showed y'all this or not in video but i have all my rifles on this little um peck board that i bought off amazon for like 40 bucks um, so we got my Lavoid up there. That's pretty much like my outdoor gun, but still safe to use indoors because it's not that long. You got my speed soft gun, my competitive gun right there. Uh, basic jack in there. Fusions in the Lavoid. The jack in there uh, works pretty well. Um, and then MP5, like I said. And I got my Springer shotgun from Walmart. Um, I got just the outdoor rail, which I'm going to get rid of. And I got my bat if anybody wants to come to my house or my room or whatever. Oh, you got him? Oh, fuck. Wow. Miss! 
I hate these mags. I hate you. I hate you too. was a ricochet. No, yeah, no, exactly. I knew once you came back, I'm like, friendly fire ricochet. You're good, dude. Right there. Yeah. 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 I could have hit you. Yeah. <laughs> Can we have a try to hit with this layout? Also, there's taller cover in this layout than there was the last. Sorry. No, no, you good, you good. No, I what? shot you after.
Иди еще раз. Please don't forget to share this video, like the video if you did enjoy it, and subscribe if you're new. Alright, see you on the next one. Perfect!